hi guys so today i'm doing something a little different than what i normally do but i wanted to do a little like savings um like binder along with doing things for a trip so i did print out some things that i purchased off of etsy if you are interested in them i will link everything that i can down below but I want to go ahead and set up this binder and show you guys hopefully how cute it ends up looking. <laughs> All right, so starting off with my binder itself, it's just this really pretty like mint ice blue color. I did pick this up off of Amazon. Um, just something simple and cute. And then I also picked up the inserts. I believe there's 12 in here, one for each month. Um, you can purchase these separately. I know you can also purchase them in like a bundle, however you're wanting to do it. Um, but I don't honestly remember what I did, but I will link what I can down below. And then also because I'm wanting this to also double as like a little travel, as you can probably see by this paper right here with the airplanes, I purchased these two inserts from Etsy. This first one being this really pretty flights one because flights can get so expensive. And then the next one is a trip that I want to plan, not for a couple years, um, but I know it's gonna be expensive, so I wanna start saving now. I want to go to Disney Alani's resort for our 10 year anniversary. So we still have a couple of years, but I know Disney can be so expensive. We have a couple trips already planned for this year and possibly next year along with buying a house. So this I think would make a great splurge vacation for a 10 year anniversary. So that is everything that is going in our binder. And then I have these inserts. So again, I purchased these off of Etsy. I didn't realize that you got three of them, but that's really nice. And then I got this one where the savings challenge for each month is 250. There was other options. This was the one that I thought, especially being a stay at home mom, this one would be more reachable for both me and then my fiance, just because again, having other things you know, going on in life and then having kids, it can get crazy. So 250, I thought was fair for us. But again, you do get all of the months of the year in these really cute little inserts. So I'm going to cut these out and we can go ahead and put them in our binder. Now that we have them all cut out, now we can put them in our inserts and then into the binder they go. Now I am just putting my little month slips into the clear inserts. That way I can pop them into my binder. And if you guys hear any truck noise, well, toy noise, I do have a toddler in the background. Um, but I did want to tell you guys, don't feel like you have to do the same dollar amount that you see someone do in their videos. I've watched tons of these. I really like them. And I think that it's a great idea to help budget and save for something but a lot of people that I've watched have always done a higher monthly amount now with a goal you want to keep it in mind to yourself and have it be a personal achievement for you don't try and stretch yourself to where you might end up stressed or bummed if you do not make it I feel like that's very important when making a goal so for us, I thought 250 was perfect. We do have kiddos and just in general, life is just not cheap anymore. Everything has gotten so expensive. So make sure that you cater everything, no matter what it is to you. And another thing I will add, remember that even the smallest things add up and can be so helpful. Even change. We have a popcorn bucket from Christmas like two years ago. We have in the bottom of our closet and we fill it up with change. You would not believe how much change gets put in that bucket that we forget about. And when we go to cash it in, it's so crazy how things add up. So do not feel discouraged if your budget or your savings amount is not as high as everybody else. I promise you will get there, but everything has to be done in your time and at your pace.
All right, and then for this one, for flights, I know that these can always change, especially from where we still have a while, but again, it cannot hurt to start saving early. And that way it's less stress closer towards the trip and you know, all of that good stuff. So I am actually going to make each plane worth 50. So I'm gonna put that down there at the bottom where it says each plane equals. And I believe if I did my math correctly, this should be about $2,500. So let us put that down. So there is that. And then we will put it in this beauty. Can't hurt to start saving early. That's all I'm gonna say. All right, and now we can go ahead and pop the rest of these in here. All right, now for these two beauties, I will stick them in the back just because, I mean, that is a far out trip that we are going to be saving for. So I will stick these in here if they will pop in here. These things are so difficult. And there we go. If you guys hear my toddler he's playing with the kitchen drawer so ignore that all right so there ignore all those little plastic pieces so now we have them all nice i'm very very happy all right so the last thing i'm gonna do for this today is because january is completely over with I am going to go ahead and add the 250 that is supposed to be in the ending goal. I'm going to go ahead and put that in here. I'll eventually color in the little mittens because I feel like that's part of <laughs> the fun little um, countdown. But once February is completely done, I will do the same thing and then I will start March doing day by day because there's only about less than a week left of February at this point. But yeah, that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope maybe you guys will get some inspiration to do a cute little binder. There's nothing wrong with saving, saving regardless of the amount or anything that you wanna do. I know life these days is crazy and nothing is cheap anymore, but I mean, this is definitely a great and cute way to do so. But I hope you guys enjoy and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.